What's going on? Yeah, man, I'm here. Thanks for having me, you know? Yeah, man, it's a pleasure. You're welcome, you're welcome, you're welcome. So, tell us um, a little bit about yourself. Where were you born and raised? Erastic is a little country boy, you know what I'm saying? Born born in Montego Bay, that's St. James. Raised up in, in, grown up in Westmoreland side, you know? So, okay. Yeah, that's where I'm really from. Oh, okay. It's the Negro, you know, most of the time, you know, back and forth. Oh, okay. So, tell us, um, you know, what got you interested in music? Oh, well, you know, my mom is a pastor, so, you know, music is always in my blood, you know. That's what I always wanted to do from, from birth. From I know myself, never wanted to be a doctor, lawyer, nurse, police. <laughs> a lie? Why not? <laughs> no, because of this music, you know, my mom, I don't know, it's just music for me, it's just all. And uh, I always I pursue that until now, and it's been... You know, doing great for me so far, thus far, even though I'm not at that real high peak journey I'm not the one to reach yet, but right. you now it's doing great wonders for me, so I can't complain. You know? Oh, okay. So, any singers in the family? Well, no, you know, as we said, that's my mother, a pastor, you know, so I just made the only singer, you know, that's my gift, so I use it. So what So what did she say when you tell her you, you want to be an a, a, a entertainer? Well, you know me choose my own destiny and my mom can't choose my destiny for me. So True. <laughs> she got, she does have to grow me up in the right way and you know instill the character with good things in me and I choose my destiny and filter out stuff stuff that I don't want and use stuff that I want, the good stuff, not the bad stuff. You know? Right, right, exactly, exactly. So, um any musical inspirations, like who inspire you like music? Oh, well, you know, Bob Marley, the king, you know. Yeah, of As, course, yeah, yes. That's my era, you know, Dennis Brown, the guys, I can all those people. You know, I, I like those, that era of music. Right. And so, sometimes, you know, if you listen to the music that I sing, you know, it has a little touch of that part, that era, it has a little touch of this new era, you know, because you don't know, it's, you have to keep it fresh and spunky, you know. True, true, true. So, what kind of music do you listen to when, you know, on your free time? I, you know, so I listen to every music, every type of music, every genre of music, you know what I'm saying? So, because I also, I have a band. Oh, you know, okay. It's not just me alone, you know, it's, right. it's my band is called Dirty Boss Crew. And Dirty so, Boss Crew, yeah, yes, so you hear that people? Dirty yeah. Boss Crew band. <laughs> it's Rasslick and the Dirty Boss Crew. <laughs> I go to different venues, I sing my original, I sing cover songs, I sing you know, if they want you some Bob Marley, whatever the crowd want to hear, entertainment. It's not just singing, you know, it's entertainment. Right, right. Okay. So it's for entertainment. Of course, it's for entertainment. Good entertainment. So tell us about this song, uh, No Shackles. Like, give us a little history about this song. Well, you know, it's the other day. You know, we just, my, my, my producer, Kaparikas, we love Kaparikas. You know, he came with the beat and. Um, I just heard something in the beat that just draw the song out to me and truly and I started to sing. I see the wanna bring back the shackles and man bring back the chains. And you know I started, you know, I did a little scratch vocals in the in the in the studio and I went back the other day and just started listening to it and I say, you know, I said, 